Synchronizing, synchronizing, three, two, one. Hello everyone, welcome back to the next episode of Amnesia The Dark Descent. I almost said Super Mario 64 Chaos Edition, because that would have been wrong. So, I'm blind. Terribly, terribly blind. People are probably going, down when you're so dumb. Uh, so, it's right there, that, that dumb stuff right there. Yeah. Okay, so I was right, the pipes could come to use. I don't know how I, or why I didn't see the holes there. I guess I was expecting something to be jutting out of the wall more than it already was. I don't know. Um, let's go this here. Kind of like um, in the first machine room. Kind of expected something like that. Okay. Just, one. Just got one more to grab. Uh, something I did see, if you didn't notice with the boxes, is that you could actually prop it open with the boxes. Like, okay, save so myself a little bit of time. Plus, apparently, after you do this, the crank breaks and you have to throw on the crank. So, but I'm going to keep that item in mind for cheating for the world. Okay. blinded him as I had done inside that murky tomb in Algeria. It was just an en as enchanting he tried to approach it, but the Baron's firm hand held him back. Okay, now go lower that. Exit for good stuff. Okay. Now what we're gonna want to go ahead and do is ladder. You can just jump off it. That works too. I didn't think that would actually work. Um, rock. Catch it, Daniel. I wonder if I hit myself in the face if that would hurt it. Probably. Again, you should hit yourself in the face. I promise. He had to treat his friend to harvest the something. That much was certain. Drinking more of my Coca-Cola. Okay. So looks like we got some water, which means probably another water monster. Good. We're conserving water from the spring. Yes, it enables me to control the water in the drain sewers to some extent. Also, it can be used for all sorts of purposes. Like for drinking? Eh, well, that too. But mostly to run different machines. Ah, like water mill. Exactly. Daniel, you simpleton. Hello? Day. 7th of August, 1839. There is no denying that Alexander puts a lot of faith into what I can only describe as magic. I'm not surprised. Even while traveling across Europe, I assumed I would have to embrace the supernatural to save my mind and life. As a novice, I do everything in my power to stay focused and not dwell too much on my own doubts. Alexander woke me up early and told me it was time we got started on our work. 
He was obviously excited to get going, and we headed downstairs to the old dungeon, where he preferred to attempt his rituals. It turns out that Alexander is a true Renaissance man, paralleled only by Da Vinci, I'm sure. He showed me several rooms fitted for specific research, such as anatomy studies, alchemy, and botany. The crown of Brennenburg must be the inner sanctum, a most hallowed ground where we shall attempt to permanently banish the orb's shadow. Okay, cool. Oh, oh finalist drop. Turn the wheel. I'm trying to Minecraft sprint in this. Ooh, I almost didn't make that jump. Okay. Head this way. Hey! Put a lot of tinder box. Okay. Didn't mean to fall in. Then, okay, I'm glad that the water monster isn't just like immediately chasing me down and murdering my face. That'd be very, very sad. Okay, so it must be actually dark enough where Daniel's like, nope. <laughs> okay, that's a rusty chain. I wonder. I keep on trying a Minecraft spit, 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 sprint yet again. Sketchy if I ever saw sketchy. Okay, and another. 8th of August, 1839. I could never be certain until today that I was on the right path. Using my orb, Alexander managed to channel its power unto us. The inner sanctum flared with blue, fiery light, and I could feel the same things I felt in the dark chamber in Algeria. It was like standing in a mad whirlpool of impressions. It was terrifying, but Alexander kept calm and wielded strange tools of science in order to tame the storm. Suddenly, the blue light was stained by strains of red, and the walls burst with pulsating tissue resonating with the scene. Alexander quickly covered the orb in some cloth, and the unspeakable thing vanished. Apparently, the orb's shadow is closer than Alexander thought. He said I should prepare for a warding ritual tomorrow. I'm not sure what he expects, but I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, jeez. So they already tried warding off the shadow. Um, redirect sewer water. Be the only thing I don't like about this game is like everywhere that you go is a maze. Uh, go ahead and turn on the lamp for this lantern, whatever you want to call it. Cross the bridge. Yeah, I haven't gone over here with all the steam. Um, guessing that's a. Ooh. Water? That's easy. Oh. For the steam. Find another journal page, diary page. Fuck out. I want to read the, the 1839. It is still early, and Alexander is busy preparing for the ritual later today. Seeing him this worked up makes me question why. What does he stand to gain? I realize he is curious about it all, but surely there must be more. 
Is he so foolish he will attempt to tame the power of the orb? I must admit that yesterday, when Alexander flooded the inner sanctum with blue light, I realized we had but graced the orb's true potential. This might turn out to be more than escaping a creeping shadow. It might be the beginning of something truly extraordinary. Testament to nature's strength being able to grow inside Brandenburg. Alas, it was Alexander's studies and care which enabled the flower. Oh. I didn't have to jump that the first time, you rude. Okay. I'll just take random damage, you butt. Okay. And actually, we're sitting at about 12 minutes. I know it's a little short for an episode. But the last episode I recorded was actually 19 minutes long when I finished recording it. And I know there's still some editing time, but I think we'll leave the worst place ever to leave. I'm going to leave the morgue for the next episode. Oh my god, why? Why? Oh god. The morgue. Enough said. Alright, well thank you guys very much for watching this episode of Amnesia the Dark Descent. And I will see you guys next time.